Geobox Video Wall Controller is a pure hardware-based display controller. It allows you to rotate, crop, position or scale images from the video sources and live stream them on multiple screens or projectors at real time. Unlike most solutions in the market, you don't need any PC software but using remote controller to configure all the settings. Of course, you can still choose to control it through Ethernet or PC too. In this video, I will use this 3x1 video wall as an example to show how to easily create video wall using Geobox. Different from other solutions, with Geobox, you can control and manipulate images at real time, without editing through PC software, so with monitors already installed, we start with connecting the input and output cables. Three HDMI cables are connected to the Geobox outputs at one side and to the input ports of each monitor at the other side. No specific connection sequence is required here, which will be set through Geobox later. Another HDMI cable is connected to Geobox input at one side, and to the signal source at the other side. A laptop is used as signal source here. Switch the power on and use remote controller comes with the box for all the settings. In this case, we have all three monitors installed in portrait direction, so we first see go to the menu of orientation function under image properties, and turn image for 270 degree. Do this for each monitor. By pressing the channel hotkey on remote control, we can change the settings for each monitor. Go to video wall menu, and use zoom to split the display in horizontal and vertical direction. In this case, we set the horizontal zoom into 3, and vertical zoom as 1. Apply this zoom setting for all monitors. Next step is to use pan to assign the location for each split image in both horizontal and vertical directions. Horizontal direction is counted from left to right and vertical direction is counted from top to bottom. Here, we set the horizontal pan setting into 1 for the monitor at the left hand side, for the monitor in the middle into 2, and for the one at the right is 3. Vertical pan setting is 1 for all monitors. At this point, we've made one content displayed on the entire video wall, but the image is not yet smooth due to the gap of bezel, so we have to do some bezel correction. Bezel correction can be performed by adjusting the overlap value. If video wall is in regular shape, we provide bezel correction calculator that helps you easily find out what overlap value should be applied. If you have a more complicated video wall, for example, with mixed size monitors or each monitor rotates in different angles, then some calculation needs to be done based on video wall dimension and bezel size. We will cover this part later in the next video. So, in less than 3 minutes, we have all the basic settings completed for our 3x1 video wall. You can tell from the testing pattern that the images are combined smoothly. Let's watch some live videos.